Phalanx Covenant Part 9. Cable and the team reach the main Phalanx Citadel. Stephen Lang feigns assimilating Psylocke, but really he's asking for her help in stopping the Phalanx. Hodge alerts him of a security breach as Harry's plane crashes into the Citadel. Things explode, but the Phalanx survives and Lang saves Psylocke. Meanwhile, Cable and the others are scaling the mountain, not using their powers to remain undetected. Lang looks over the captured X-Men and Hodge suggests killing them, but Lang lies and says he needs to study them. The others continue their ascent up the mountain and Lang senses them coming but says nothing. He convinces Psylocke to act as a sleeper agent within the Phalanx Collective. Cable reaches an impasse and Jean uses her powers briefly to quickly give him a boost. Hodge detects it, but Lang throws him off the scent and the X-Men continue climbing. Psylocke is now merged and she reveals Lang's treachery, but Hodge doesn't believe her. Cable's team reaches the top and they enter the Citadel blasting. Wolverine frees the X-Men as Cable and the others become overwhelmed. The X-Men burst into action and Psylocke is freed from her possession as Lang escapes. The psychics bombard the Phalanx Cyanide and Phalanx around the world are destroyed. The Citadel collapses and the X-Men escape and Hodge drags Lang into oblivion with him. The Phalanx home planet makes a new plan to assimilate Earth.